None of that stuff can affect you. You forgive them. Have compassion on them. What a bunch of lunatics and idiots. They lost a kingdom. They lost the empress. They lost the tree of life. They lost their path to the most high. They lost all their money. Getting ready to lose more. They're going to jail. Their reputation is tarnished. All the lies and rumors that were said and defamation were said. That is back on them like a beating blood vessel that's going to stay on repetition. Guilt. That ruins guilt, anger, all that stuff ruins your organs. The guilt alone could kill somebody. And I look forward to justice being brought on every energy harvesting, witch, warlock, demon, all this stuff. I would love all of this and all the people that are doing this. And this is just in regards to me. Who knows who else they're doing it to? I'm going to speak up about it because people need to know what's going on in public. People need to know who the evil, jealous, envious, control freaks, and truly all of them, the worst ones I've found are the most insecure ones. Insecure about everything. Fucking weak. They're cowards. All this be on the news. Every person that did spell work on me, every witch, warlock, practitioner, worker around the clock, uh, forged documents, uh, paid off attorneys, cops, even though they was doing magic spells on them as well. And they were told. And they thought it was a joke. It's not even about being right or wrong with these individuals. It's about them controlling something with their insecure, insignificant ass. Because that's what you got to do over there. You got to control something or someone in order to get clout and money. You don't control shit, bitch. Nobody on this earth controls anything. The Most High controls everything. And he gives branches to whomever he wants. Satan is the leader of his dark side. The dark side of the Most High. Satan leads that. So if you insecure and all that weak ass shit, you're going to be over there with him. You're not going to be standing next to me. I'm very confident in who I am, what I am, where I'm going, and what I want to do on this earth. And I rebuke all demons that come for me. It's not the demon, it's the stupid witch and warlock. I rebuke all evil witches and warlocks that are coming for me or have been or been Harvesting on my energy, but you you big and bad out there, right? You got all the all the all the money and all of this and all of that, but you ain't got your own energy source. You feeding off everybody else, but you big and bad. You ain't got shit. You feeding off of me. Feed off your own damn energy. Oh, you ain't got none, cause you're dead inside. You sold out. You don't got no energy, you ain't got no spirit, you ain't got no heart. But you big and bad out here on these streets, but you ain't got your own shit. You ain't got your own you. You don't even own you. Trying to play mind games and Jekyll and Hyde and uh, Pink Panther and all of this. In people's lives, acting like you're controlling. I got people talking about they a matriarch of this family. Who the fuck made you a matriarch? You're not even a part of this bloodline. Who is your father? Who the fuck are you?
Some lab bitch. You don't know nothing about this over here. So anyway, I call back all my energy. You, you, you listeners would not even. You probably wouldn't even be surprised at the the names of the celebrities and the Illuminati and the occult members and people on T. All of this obsession and stalking and energy harvesting. The police are watching. The FBI are watching. They listening. Good. There's people sending demons over here right now to do energy harvesting. Because they ain't got no energy. They ain't got no light. She got all the light. Promoter God's got all the light. So I'm going to attack her. I'm going to break that bitch down. You ain't finna break shit down, nigga. You going to jail. You going to hell. And you going to suffer. If the Most High decides to show courtesy to give you days on this earth to be lived out. For the sentence that he's getting ready to put on you. You will think about this for the rest of your life. Some of these people going into straight jackets. These people going into mental institutions. All these motherfuckers. They're all con artists. They're all possessed. They're all dead. They're thieves. They abuse women. They prostitute children. They're drug addicts. They're obsessed. They're obsessed. They're obsessed. They're obsessed. They're possessed. They are possessed. They are shapeshifters. They're deceivers. They're thieves. They're liars. They're abusers. They abuse women, animals, children, everything. And they're going to jail. And I'm going to already thank the people that's there in jail waiting for their ass to get there. Because they're going to tear their motherfucking ass the fuck up for all the hell and unnecessary conflict and chaos they brought on this earth. Thinking they some damn God. You ain't no God. You ain't even got your own energy, bitch. You need Peter to go rob Paul to get some energy. You completely codependent on something or someone. These people will never be whole again. Who knows if they ever were. Doing all of this black magic and stalking and shit in the background. You fucking cowards. Fuck you. It's a new beginning and your ass ain't rolling. Your ass ain't going. It's for mortal goddess. I'ma keep it moving. Dead this shit. Dead these karmics. Dead these lifeless, soulless, pathetic, lunatic ass motherfuckers. Thank you to the FBI, the CIA, and the police. You are going to be legendary for this arrest. Arresting these people. Legendary. This is going to be the biggest arrest of your career. You will probably go like be put on a plaque or something for all the police departments across the world to acknowledge as a hero as someone to look up to and follow and I think that is an awesome gift if you're willing to embark and embrace it from the most high any attorney, any police officer, any sheriff, any IRS worker, anybody that's going to stand with this and arrest these people, they will be legends on this earth. And I guarantee that. It's going to be the biggest move of their career. I don't think any of them are going to sacrifice the biggest link up of their career 
for fucking a hundred grand and be quiet. No. These are some trifling, possessed, lunatic, loser ass people. They're not even people, they're entities. They're bodysuits. And that's what I was talking about earlier on Promoter Goddess. But y'all to check that out. I'm gonna go. Cause it's just the the conversation is it's too heavy. Cause they heavy and I'm light. And I don't really wanna I don't I'm done with it. I'm done with them. I'm done with that energy, those spirits. They have nothing to offer. They never did. All I have to offer is some poisoned sex and an illusion and a bunch of fucking mind games, spell work, and lies. I bid you adieu. Oh, goddess. Be safe out there. <laughs> be safe out there. You hear? Go ahead and be safe out there. You hear? <laughs> Thank you, listeners, for being here. Shabbat shalom. I'm crazy. I'm high in the name of Yahweh Shai. I'm the beloved ancestors. Shalom.